Okay, so we have the iPad as the second monitor, as you can see. Actually, I have three monitors here, but you know, you see. And sorry about the cable management there. But what you're gonna have to do to achieve this is uh, quite simple. So the first thing we're gonna have to do here is I'm just gonna disconnect this. So we're gonna have first to go to settings on iPad and then here on iPad you're gonna have to make sure here on iPad you select you go to general and then here in sorry about this the way I'm uh, I'm recording this but I think this can be more helpful general and then here in air airplay and handcuff make sure you enable all of that continuously cursor hand call, hand off very helpful all of them just enable and then make sure you're connected to the same to the same iCloud on your iPad on your uh, MacBook as well the same iCloud same account very simple you know on your iPhone you have the same iCloud make sure it is, it is the same on your iPhone iPad and then what you're gonna have to go do is to go here on your MacBook and then click on this icon and then here select Miro. And then here I'll select the iPad. And then here you have the option to use it as a separate display. And to be honest, it's very fast, no laggy at all. Um, it's not connected like uh, you don't have to use a cable, it's just charging my iPad right now. That's why I have that cable plugged in the iPad but you don't have to use any cable. It works wire, uh, Wi-Fi wirelessly. It's no problem, fast, really nice, really fast. Look, is uh, very smooth. So yeah, if you found this helpful and you learned something, make sure you subscribe. I will really, really appreciate it if you subscribe. Like this video if you found this helpful and thanks for watching. Take care.